What's up guys, your boy Vasquez here today. I'm going to show you something I found. Um, it's a pretty good run for grinding up uh, skill rep to put into your skill talent trees for Sekiro. This game is really difficult. It's only been out a couple days, still getting used to it. Um, but as you can see, I've only been farming for like an hour and I've just been killing it, filling out these skill trees with this spot. I'm currently working on increasing my healing gourd for four. As you can see, I'm at the end of two right now. Got a little bit of two left, and you'll see how much we have. So you want to go to the Hirata Estate to the Bamboo Thicket Slope um, Shrine. And what we're going to do is kind of a figure eight here. So we're going to run up the hill, and we're going to take the path to the left. And you'll see the kind of theme that I'm going for here is we're going to sneak attack a guy, and then we're usually going to um, use our R2, our hatchet arm, against another guy. So make sure you crouch when you jump up here. Take out this guy, and then this other guy is just a little bit. You can just sort him down. You don't have to worry about doing any special attacks or anything like that. So, after you kill them, we're going to crouch, of course, and we're going to go around this fire to the right, and we're going to take out the archer. Now, you'll see these two guys walking down the hill in front of him. If you do this quick enough, you can get to them before they get to the end of their path. If not, just hit these bushes up on the right and wait for them to come back and take them out. So, you can take out... Bitch tits right here, and then turn on this guy, and we're going to use that R2 as he's waving his torch at us, wasting time, split his throat, and we're going to move on. Now, the R2 is going to be really big coming up from here, especially when we're going to deal with some of these harder guys that have the axe that take a little bit. This is a little sloppy that's coming up right here, but you can see I don't even need to use a healing gourd to work. So, we'll sneak attack this guy. We're going to turn on him, who's already swinging at us. Use the R2 to kind of stagger him and get him back. I think he gets a little bit away from me here, yeah. But, you know, he's done. So we're going to drop into the bushes over here because there's an archer. Um, and you'll most likely be familiar with this place because you have to go through it to get to the shrine that I'm talking about. But he's right up here. You'll sneak attack him. And again, the guy with the torch is going to aggro on you, but he just stands there and waves it around at you for a second. Plenty of time to come up, knock him in the face with your axe, to his throat, and move on. So up ahead are two guys with shields. So we'll sneak attack the one on the right, and then the one on the left we will hit with the R2 to break his shield. And then we'll, we'll finish him off. The guy with the torch again is going to aggro on us, but he's going to wave the torch around, and we'll move in, and we'll do the exact same thing to him, and GG. Now, these guys down at the bottom sometimes will aggro on I don't know what causes it, um, when they do or they don't, so I usually just kind of come back up here to make sure I'm good, then I'll come down and do the same thing. Again, there's a nasty axe guy, and I'm not the best with the blocks, you know, the game's been out for three days now, so... Getting better on the deflections and the blocks, but uh, the, the formula works. Again, I don't even need to use the healing board at all. And as you can see, I'm already at least a quarter of the way into level 3 with that skill talent. And I was I had, what, at least a quarter left of level 2 to get in there? So you're grinding, and I've been doing this for an hour, so I've, I've been killing it with the points. You're getting at least a half a level of run, and it takes, what, 3 minutes? So it, it, I think it's really effective, especially for how early on in the game we are. Um, hopefully it'll help me out with the harder boss fights because some of them are kicking my ass. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll like and subscribe if you're new. Let me know if you want me to play more Sekiro. Until um, next time, guys. Peace out.